What's going on gamer Sir here welcome back to the channel now today I'm gonna to teach you how you can respawn Ivy the poisonous mask She of course is either the fourth or fifth boss you're gonna encounter depending on the route that you took Now for me she was down here kind of pretty close to the clay biome and uh, She was down south more but on here she's obviously gonna be in a different spot whenever you find her location you defeat her Nothing else happens. There's no other vendors that has her item to uh, respawn her. So you have the giant slime summoning idol, you have the gorm summoning idol, and you have the hive mother. So you're probably wondering, how do I respawn her? Well, you can actually purchase the basic, just the giant slime summoning idol, and it actually works for her too. So it says here, the crystal idol to reawaken a giant slime consumed upon placing it on any giant slime summoning rune. So I could see how that could confuse a lot of people. So you just purchase it from the second vendor for 500 ancient coins. And I'm going to head over there and we'll place it down and we will take her on. All right, we've made our way to the arena. Uh, sorry about the mess. I do a ton of testing on this game. So that's why I have a moat around. And turns out whenever she attacks you, she will actually rebuild ground. So you can't box her in like that. But anyways, whenever you bring the summoning idol here, you just drop it on here and it's going to work the same. I'm going to go ahead and pop these potions real fast. Just so I don't die and uh, we'll try to take her out really quick. She does hit hard as always. So the reason that you're going to want to constantly like farm her is because you're going to want to be able to grab all the exclusive loot that she has. And um, she has like a ring and a necklace, which I already have, but she can also drop some of the trophies and some figurines that you might want for your collection. So let me go ahead and finish her off real fast before she kills me. Pop one of these. I'll put that just for the glow. And uh, if you don't kill her fast enough, she respawns, which is super frustrating about this boss. She's probably the most annoying boss in this entire game. Even worse than the bird and uh, the secret boss over there on the Forgotten Ruins. So we're going to pop our last potion here, finish her off really quick. Okay, we're just punching her. There we go. So my super came in clutch right there. Like I said, you're going to want to refarm her over and over just so... <laughs> just so you can get the exclusive loot all right we made it back to our loot and the craziest thing is we got the ivy's ring the ivy's thorn harness the chest the poisonous sickle and ivy's pants all the drop from defeating that boss just that one time we got all of that stuff we got super super lucky and these are the items you want to farm for and this is why you want to resummon that boss the ivy's pants give you plus 65 max health plus 31 percent critical hit damage and it's part of a set. So if I combine this with the ring or this with the chest, it'll give me an additional 26% critical hit chance after applying poison. You, of course, apply poison by using the poisonous sickle, which has a 28% chance to apply poison on hit. Now, the chest piece gives you another 70 max health, 31% critical hit, and then the set bonus there. So what that means is I have 606 health here. If I take the Scarlet Breastplate off, the Scarlet Pants, put the Thorn Harness, the Ivy's Pants on, put the Poisonous Sickle in my hand, I have 691 health. I got almost 100 health more just from wearing these two sets, not including anything else I could add over here. So you could really increase your health by a lot. Now, this Poisonous Sickle... I am going to say that it can do more damage than the Rune Sword thanks to all of the critical hit damage if you have the full set. Because if you look over here, I have 195% critical hit damage and my melee is very high, 306 to 374. So let's go find a slime and we're going to hit him. Hopefully we get a crit. So we hit him once. Look how much uh, damage we did, 409. So we need one more. We, we really need to get a critical hit so you can see how much this is. 1246. What other weapon in this game can do that much damage? And uh, so look at that. 453. If I use this ancient pickaxe, which used to be the best, it's only 253. Like, it's insane how much damage this poisonous sickle uh, does with this set. So go out there, farm this as much as you can. And uh, I really hope you learned something in this video. If you did... Consider subscribing to the channel. You can always change your mind later and uh, unsubscribe. That's fine. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys on the next one.